I just wanted to take a minute and uh, welcome all new subscribers to our channel who have recently subscribed. I'm Rome and this is my wife Rachel and this is our channel. We do food reviews, product reviews, uh, we DIY and vlogs. We do a little bit of everything. We try to have a, a good variety there for everybody. So yes, I have one announcement. We do have this the ice, Mountain Dew ice, where you're going to be doing a, a product to get everybody. Tonight, me and Rachel are making Anyways, tacos. Uh, Rachel's cooking hamburger, I'll show you. Right over there, see it in the pan. And I got the Taco Bell seasoning. We went That's down. better. Anyways, you want to show them? What? Me? Yeah, what, I bought some for Rachel today. I haven't bought her one for a year. I so. For one dollar, guys. Yeah, I cut it a little too short for this base, but... Yeah. So, guys, I've taken uh, and chopped some onion. It's a yellow onion. Chopped just enough to go in this cup. And then we got some shredded lettuce. And then we got some generic cheese. And it is consistent of... Let's see what kind of cheeses are in it. Pasteurized milk, cheese culture, salt, Monterey Jack cheese, cheddar cheese, and it's got a little bit of seasonings in it as well. Some taco shells, and these are burrito style flour tortillas, which these work the greatest for soft tacos if you're going to make them at home. And then you know, just a bag of cheap shirt less, it was like a buck ninety nine and some cheese, whatever. Ten dollars, they're about price point. You can have yourself a nice little taco dinner with you and your sweetheart. Ten tacos. Me and Rachel will probably have maybe two each, and then the rest will just heat up at another point when we get hungry. All right, our ground beef is cooked, so now we're about ready to add the seasoning and the. Actually, and, uh, drain it. Yeah, we got to drain it first. So this taco seasoning calls for three fourths of a cup of water. So we don't need quite a cup. We'll get our three quarter cup out of here then. Which I believe is right here. There's a th three quarter cup of water. I will fill that right now. I do believe our ground beef is now ready for uh, to have the seasoning added to that. I'll open up the taco seasoning here and we'll add that. So it says, Simmer on medium heat to low heat for 10 minutes. Stir it occasionally. And this, there are lots of different seasonings you can buy for your tacos out there. There's lots of different brands. And of all the brands that are available, the Taco Bell one is by far my favorite, personally. So, we got everything all done and heated up. I got the skillet going here with a tortilla in it. You want a tortilla, honey? Thank you. Yeah. The reason I like to heat up the tortillas is because when they're softer, they're easier to handle, they're easier to fold and roll and all that. When they're cold, they kind of send a tear and they're really hard to work with. Having us good tacos. Homemade is always the best to me. All right, so there we got about that much meat. And then we'll put some cheese. Oh, and there we have it, everybody. A nice soft taco. I'll roll that up and then we'll eat it up. Make some more. They're just rolled up, guys. Yes, sir. We're gonna tear into this one and try it out and see how we like it. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. <laughs> so delicious. So I tell you, everybody. Very good. Very. Mmm. And we're gonna wrap up the video, guys. So there you have it. This homemade dog was with Rachel and myself. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Yes. So while uh, Rachel was draining that, um, whoops, I just spilled the water. Great. I tore my tortilla all up. Uh oh. I ripped my tortilla. Oh well. 